So let me write down equation 17.47 first. And since the detector has uh, no velocity, the detector is at rest. Therefore, Vd is equal to 0, which gives F dash to be equal to this equation. Now we will take value for F dash and F double dash, which is for recession. So F dash is for approach and then we have F double dash, which is for recession. That is when the wave is going away from the detector. Let, let me draw a diagram which will keep make this simple. So this is the detector, this is source and the observer which is us is at the detector. So here is the observer and we are calculating everything with respect to the observer because this is us. Now, since the wave is going towards the detector on the first case, like when for the approach, we have the wave going from source to detector, which means that according to observer, the wave is going towards the detector and away from the source. And because of this, F dash should be greater than f because it's going towards the detector and away from the uh, source and if this is the case then we will choose our signs accordingly and this is only possible when we have a minus sign over here instead of plus because if we have a plus this will mean that frequency will decrease f dash will be less than f and that's not what we want. Now, similarly for the recession case, so in that case, the wave is going back to the source from the detector and according to the observer, this, this will see that the wave is going away from the detector and is moving towards the source. And this means that F dash or F double dash is less than F now. And therefore we should have a positive sign here because we want F double dash to be less than F. And that's only possible when the denominator is greater than the numerator. And now we have both the equations that we want and therefore the difference in the frequencies between approach and recession and we have to take f dash minus f double dash not f double dash minus f dash because we already know that f dash is greater than f and f double dash is less than f which means that f dash is greater than f double dash so we want this difference to be positive and this is equal to v over v minus v s minus v over v plus v s and this gives this expression to be 2v v s over v over 1 minus v s over v square. You don't need to do this, but yeah. Now setting f dash minus f double dash over f equal to half will lead to an equation so this is equal to Vs over V over 1 minus Vs over V squared. Okay, so we are expressing this or we are simplifying this uh, into something like this because we want the ratio of Vs over V. So this is the best we can do to get that. And this will make our calculations easier as well. So this is what we get after setting this expression to half. And from here, we can solve for Vs over V. So that's our 
one that's like one variable now so vs over v will come out to be root over of 2 minus root over of 5 minus 2 and that is equal to 0 0.2 v6 so that is the ratio vs over v 